Hey everyone, I'm Cat. This is Transistor. Let's get started. We're not going to get away with this, are we? Come on, pull. There. Together again. Sort of. Well? Let's take a quick look around before we get moving. Figure something out. Movement's pretty simple. WASD moves right around. Down here at the bottom, we have our loadout. Right now, we have two functions. That's crash. Get the hang of this. Comes out kind of fast. Doesn't do up a lot of damage. Stuns enemies for about three seconds. This is Breach. Does considerably more damage than Crash. It can move through some objects, but it's got to charge up time. What a night. You're still in one piece. That's all that matters. already. They want you back, I bet. Well, the process. Let's crack them open. Well, so do I. Born again. First important thing to note. When enemies die, they drop a cell. Nice. If you don't pick it up, they come okay, back. let's go. Unmarked alley. East of the bay. I think I know where we are. Here's the most powerful ability of the transistor, the turn. There's a whole lot to it. The game's gonna be nice and guide us through this first one. I'll explain how it works later, but for now, let's make it happen. Alright, so here's how turn works. Up at the top, that blue bar, that's our planning potential. Anything we do, uses it up. And when it gets full, you can't do any more. Now let's say that we don't like what we've planned out. Well, we can take it all back one move at a time with the R button. The world is frozen while we plan out our turn so we can take our time plotting out all of our movements and functions. We can see the effects that our functions will have on the process, how much damage it'll do, if the function will combo out with any other functions we've previously done, how much health the process will be left over with once we're done with them. Now you notice, we only have a little bit of potential left, but we can put a full nother breach on there. If we have any amount of potential left over at all, we can commit another process to it, regardless of how much potential it should actually use. Now all that's left is to mop up. And that's that. We're clear. Okay, time to move on.
there's the empty set. Still too close to it. We better get as far from there as possible. Block party up ahead. Here we go. Yeah, another new process in addition to the creep from before. Something nice about Breach? We can line it up if we hold down the execute button. Now. Sometimes it's a little Get deceptive. Out of here. Spark. You see that tooltip there? It's actually three ways to select. You can click on the function's picture. You can use the number keys like it suggested. Or you can use the scroll wheel on your mouse. I don't like doing that one though, because the direction is reversed for some reason, and you can't switch it. Intersection. Let's see. Cloud Bank Fashion Week not happening, huh? Three days this time. Terminal north of the door we came in. Let's go check it out. Wish it was raining. Cover your tracks. Rain's not even on the ballot. Well, if we can't have it rain, might as well have it nice out. Warm and clear winds again. Well, time to show off Spark. We can see, based on the red dots, looks like Spark has a pretty nice area of effect to it. Gross. Good for clearing out groups like this. No problem. How to keep heading east. The real strength of the young lady is that once you hit them, they teleport away, and they leave a clone behind. Trick us. The clones are just smoke. They only have one HP. But they can attack just like the real ones. Forget the copies, get the real deal. And when the young ladies die, they spawn out of a whole bunch of cells with a really short timers on them. When the timers are up, they reform into these. Side Street, due east. Through there. I think I know a place we could get a ride. This didn't used to be here.
said we might need a second person. Wait a sec. Speed dash. Interesting. Minimal damage. Go where it suits you, right? Good for running away. But as you can see, you can't pass through solid objects with it. Oh no. Cut off our escape. Here's our third major process. The jerk. Come on then, tough guy. Jerks are faster than creeps. Not quite fast as young ladies, though. They deal a whole lot of damage, too. Jerk. Back where they belong. Hey! Alright. Level up. Access to some new functions. We've got Bounce, and Mask. Mask is really powerful, but it's a support role, and I would rather kit myself out with some offense first. So we're gonna take Bounce. We're still here. Look at that. We will look at that. Next time, though. <laughs>